Hey, what's up, CVLCC? Mr. Lou here. Today is May 1st, and you know what that means. It means it's College Signing Day. College Signing Day is a day where seniors all across the nation make their decisions and official commitments to where they'll be attending school this fall. We are super excited for this class of 2020 at CVLCC. So excited, in fact, that we've decided to have a CVLCC College Signing Day COVID edition. You'll be hearing interviews, some sharing from teachers, and from our seniors themselves on where they will be going this fall. It'll go something like this. Congratulations, class of 2020, on this special day. Very tough decision to decide where you are going to further your education. And just know that we at CVLCC are very proud and very honored that you will seek and go and transform our world. Thank you. Hi, class of 2020. This is Mrs. Tessier jumping in on College Signing Day Home Edition. Just letting you know that I am so proud of each and every one of you and that I'm so excited to hear all of your announcements today on our College Signing Day CBLCC style. Hey, CBLCC, this is Mr. Ruth here. Just wanted to come on to Zoom, say congratulations. Wanted to let you know I got to go to University of Hawaii. I loved it. It was a great experience. You're going to love college. And again, congratulations on College Signing Day. Woo! Hey, seniors, uh, I just want to say congratulations um, for getting into the colleges that you applied for. Um, I was so admiring of, of how hard you guys were working to go through that whole process, getting good grades, doing extracurricular activities to put on your application and to applying to all these different schools and writing your essays. And I just want to share that, you know, college was, that was it for me. When I, as a young adult, I was, felt so alive. This step, uh, the second I stepped foot on the UCSD campus, um, you're going to have so much fun. There are so many great opportunities for you um, in higher education. And you're going to have amazing professors. And I know you're going to do great. Um, so please keep in touch. We can't wait to see how things are going for you guys, but just know that I'm with you and I'm so proud of you. Hi seniors, it's Mr. Marcus. I just wanted to give you a huge congratulations on College Signing Day um, to wish you the very best and to tell you that it's not where you go, it's what you do when you're in college that counts. Good luck. Hey seniors, um, I've known a lot of you since you were in eighth grade and it has been one of the great joys of my life, getting to see you go so far to get to this point. And I'm just so proud of you. And I'm sure wherever you go, you're going to be a light in that place, just like you were in, well, not this place. This is my kitchen, but you get the idea. Hey, seniors. Well, congratulations. You made it. Uh, this is your college signing day, and I'm so excited and so happy for you all. Uh, good luck, and wherever you decide to go, just know that you have a teacher here at CVLCC that is waiting to hear from you, uh, to hear all those adventures and all the wonderful things that you'll be doing in the future. Good luck. I'll miss you. The school won't be the same without you. Uh, it's been four wonderful years, and I'm so happy that I was able to be part of that path, and I'm gonna miss you all. Bye. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead with our first batch of videos. Seniors, why don't you tell us where you're going this fall? University. Hi, my name is Emma. I'm currently a senior and I'm going to be attending Sacramento State for the fall of 2020 as undeclared. I just want to thank all my family, friends, and teachers for helping me out. Special shout out to Ms. V. Hola, mi nombre es Sergio Sofea y acudiré a la Universidad de Utah. Hi, my name is Aldir Lopez and I'm going to be studying software engineering at Cal State San Marcos. Yeah! <laughs> Hi, my name is Valeria Rivas and I'll be majoring in biochem at Cal State San Marcos. 
My name is Sebastian Montiel. I'm in 12th grade, and the, for the fall, I will be attending San Diego State, studying public health. Go Aztecs! Hi, my name is Jimena, and I will be attending Point Loma Nazarene University in the fall. See you at the point. Hi, my name is Maritza, and I am super excited to say that this fall, I am going to be attending UC Davis, with a major in Neurobiology, Physiology, and Behavior. And I just wanted to give a special thanks to all the awesome counselors and the awesome teachers. Hi, my name is Angelina Padilla, and I'll be committing to Sacramento State for the fall of 2020 with a major in Criminal Justice. I'd just like to give a big thank you to my family and friends who've always helped me and supported me. I'd also like to give an even bigger thank you to the CVLCC staff who's always been there for us. Thank you. Hey, my name is Sebastian Arianna, and I will be going to UC San Diego. Woo! Go Tritons! My name is Samantha Carrillo and I'll be attending UCI majoring in criminal justice. I'm Alexandra Espinosa. I'll be attending CSU Los Angeles and I'll be majoring in public health. Hi, my name is Vianney Marin and I will be joining Columbia University's class of 2024. Hi, my name is Estelle Rosario. I'm going to Sacramento State. My name is Sierra Carmine and I will be enlisting in the United States Air Force. Hi, I'm Eric Garcia and I'm going to go to Southwestern College. I'm Marina Villegas. I'm going to Southwestern College and I study computer and science. I'm Edgardo Hernandez and I'll be attending Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. Go Mustangs! Hi guys, my name is Nicole Escamilla and I'm extremely excited to announce that I've officially committed to UCLA. I'll be majoring in physiological sciences on a pre-med track. I'd like to thank my teachers, counselors, friends, and family for all the support they've shown me because I couldn't have done it without you guys. Go Bruins! Hi, my name is Eric Mayado, and for fall 2020, I'm going to be attending Cal State San Marcos. Go Cougars! Hi, I'm Alexa, and I'm a senior from CVLCC, and I'm going to be attending San Diego City College to pursue my career of cosmetology, and I am class of 2021. Hey guys, my name is Priscilla Palomino, and I will be staying in the state of California and going to attend Concordia University in Irvine. Yay! I'm going to be able to go to Disney. Hello, my name is Kai Vidrio. I'm currently planning on attending UC Riverside and transferring over to UC San Diego, majoring in human biology. I plan on attending medical school and residency so that I can become an orthopedic surgeon. I have another 12 years to go. My name is Anthony Garcia, and I'm going to be attending Southwestern and studying entrepreneurship and small business. Hi, my name is Itzel Espino, and I will be attending Southwestern College my first two years and transferring to SCSU and majoring in kinesiology. Hello, my name is Hector Robles, and in fall 2020, I'll be attending San Diego State. Hi, my name is Elsa Jones. I will be attending Sac State for fall 2020, and I'll be majoring in social work. I want to give a huge thanks to my family and friends and to all the teachers. Hi, my name is Jose Saldano. And next year, I'll be attending the University of California, San Diego, and I'll be majoring in mechanical engineering. Hi, I'm Luis Vasquez, and I'm going to UCSD. Hello, my name is Bernie Gaines. First and foremost, I'd like to thank God for all the blessings he's given me and my family. Secondly, I'd like to thank my mother. She's my rock, my biggest supporter. Nothing else is possible without you, Mom. I love you. And the university I'm going to be committing to is San Marcos. I'd like to thank all the teachers who assisted me with this journey. I'd like to thank Mr. Lou for all the tough nights and motivation. Mr. Gum. Five years is a lot, but we came a long way. Thank you, Ms. Tessier, for the long chats and fun laughs. Thank you. Mr. McPherson, even though you're not here, hey, you helped me a lot during sophomore year. I appreciate you. And Coach Mike, Coach Cam, Coach B, I love y'all. Thank you for everything. That was awesome. Thanks for dressing up, Luis. Now, we've had a chance to interview some of our seniors about their decisions. Let's take a look at that. I'm here with Nicole Escamilla, and she's going to talk to us a little bit about her decision. So where are you going to school, Nicole? Well, if you couldn't already tell, I'm going to UCLA. <laughs> Woo! Congratulations. I, I know that you also got into Berkeley. 
So yeah. tell us a little bit about your decision making process and why you chose UCLA. You got into Santa Barbara too, right? My yeah. alma mater. Yeah. Okay, so why did you choose UCLA over <laughs> Berkeley or Santa Barbara? Um, well, I'll tell you, it wasn't an easy decision. I cried a lot about it, and um, they know that. They, <laughs> they, like, it got to the point where I, I kept asking, like, oh, what do you think? What do you think? Where they just kept telling me, like, you're annoying. Go do it yourself. <laughs> but, you know, I eventually came up to the decision. Um, I don't know. I just felt like once I really got into UCLA, I didn't think it was going to happen. So I was like, oh my gosh. And then I got into Berkeley and I was like, oh my gosh, I got into there too. Cause I always thought like, if I even can get into any like period, like I'd either get into one or the other. So I wouldn't have to make a decision, but you know, I got into both. Um, but then I think in the end, I always had the thought in the back of my mind that I wanted to go to UCLA. Like it was always there. Cause it has been my dream school since literally like, sixth grade seventh grade since i met you most certainly is there any other yeah. reason why ucla is special to you that you can share with us um well i guess you know because <laughs> my mom went there but i think also pers like personally um you know berkeley is a beautiful campus we went we visited just last year and it's in an awesome area i because san francisco is right there and i just I really liked it and I thought I wanted to go there like really bad when I went and visited. Um, but I think another reason why I chose UCLA was because I'm a very, um, like I'm a big family person. So just the thought of like having to leave so far from all my family and like friends and stuff, I just, I, it's not gonna work for me. Like it wouldn't work. Like I would have probably cried every day. I would have been super homesick. So just like for me, UCLA was the best option because I'm far enough away where I can learn to be independent, which is something really important to me. But also my parents are just a call away and two hours away. And I have family who live in um, LA area too. So it was pretty much the perfect decision. That's awesome. Mom, how do you feel with Nicole going to your alma mater? I, I mean, I, I'm very proud. I'm very um, excited for her. I was very, very happy when she made that choice. Um, obviously, my, you know, my husband and I, we, let, we left it up to her. You know, we were going to support her regardless of where she went. And, uh, but her making the final choice to go there, I mean, what can I say? It's a beautiful campus. We've taken a few, um, visit, we've gone there and visited it several times. And I showed Nicole where I walked, where I took naps. <laughs> and where and where I studied so it was it was it's a good feeling I mean and knowing that she'll be far not too far away and knowing that you know family is nearby at a phone you know just a phone call away so that's we're very proud of her <laughs> and we're extremely proud of her being a part of the Bruin family too so Shout out to both of you for joining us on this college signing day home edition Thank you so much and go UCLA. Yay. I know you had a lot of choices when it came to choosing your university, but why did you ultimately choose Point Loma? Well, I chose Point Loma for many reasons. One of them is it has been kind of like, my eyes have been set on this university since I was in sophomore year. And also it has Christian, um, principles like they teach a lot of, they're very community it's a community-based school so I really enjoy that coming from CVLCC it kind of related to me in that sense and CVLCC is also kind of like a community-based school also it's very close to home it has a beautiful view it's right off Sunset Cliff so it's really pretty they have a amazing psychology department and I have a lot of, I have two friends that go to Point Loma already so it's just an exciting thing for me in general so and it's a private school so it's also great to have a private school education yay congratulations <laughs> hey the, happy college deciding day this is Mrs. Espino and I'm here with Jimmy Corrales who would have imagined that as a freshman this would be your path on heading to college how are you feeling Jimmy I'm feeling pretty excited. I'm excited to explore new things at San Marcos, and I'll be studying criminal justice. And I'm excited to see what, have, what comes after that. 
Thank you, Jimmy. I'm so proud. Love you. Happy college signing day, everyone. I'm here with VNA. VNA, you want to just tell us where you've decided again to go? Um, I decided to go to Columbia University. Awesome. What was it like making your decision? Um, it was kind of, it was easy, but it was also really like stressful because everything kind of fell into place. Like, first of all, like Columbia was kind of like one of my first choices. Uh -huh. And it's also like surprisingly the cheapest school for me to go to. Uh -huh. Um, but then there's like the whole pandemic thing. So I was like, do I really want to leave <laughs> to go to New York City when everyone's dying? But I figured, you know, it wouldn't really be like permanent and I might as well just like take the opportunity and leave. And like worst case scenario, I don't like it and I can always come back. Yeah, that's awesome. What, what does it feel like being the first CVLCC student to go to an Ivy League school? Like how does that dawning on you? Um, I guess it's kind of exciting. I don't, I don't just just doing business yeah that's awesome um and oh what are you excited about for in terms of college and what's that that's gonna look like living in the city um i guess i'm excited i'm excited because um it's probably like the only opportunity i'll get to live in new york for that cheap uh -huh. um and I don't know, I have a bucket list of things that I want to do. What are some um, of those bucket lists? Um, I don't know. I guess one of the big ones. Um, so when I was like in fourth grade, my dream school was my dream. Yeah, my dream school was Cambridge. Um, you know, like the in UK. England. And uh -huh. they have like a, yeah, they have like a study abroad program that you can sign up to like go to like either Oxford or Cambridge like in your junior year. So I'm excited to like sign up for that and see if I can go. That's pretty sweet. And any special shout outs finish us off here? Um, I guess a shout out to like everyone that supported me and all my friends that like told me that I could, you know, do it and that I could get in and like shout out to my mom and my dad, you know, if it weren't for my mom and like me being afraid of like getting in trouble <laughs> for not doing my homework, I probably would not have gotten where I got. That's awesome. VNA, congratulations. You know we're proud of you and we love you and we wish you the best of luck. Thank you. All right, Eric, congratulations. Happy uh, college signing day. Um, heard you're on your way to San Marcos. Why'd you choose San Marcos? Uh, just uh, for some independence, um, a different chapter in my life, be with um, my friends and new experiences all right congratulations again excited for you thanks woohoo happy college signing day maritza where will you be in the fall this fall i'm gonna be attending uc davis and i'm super excited i feel like davis was the best fit for me and it will just make me be more independent and i'm super happy maritza we are super happy for all of you seniors as well and for an unconventional year and an unconventional ending to the year for a special unconventional group of seniors. We're so, so, so proud of you and we love y'all so much. You know, and as uncertain as the future may seem and as uncertain as all of these things and the path looks, the one thing that we are certain of here at CVLCC is that you group of seniors, like every group of seniors before you, will undoubtedly make us proud. Sometimes words can't express how we feel. So, We'll just let Nicole show you how we truly, truly feel.